Good afternoon, Bond. If you look down at your feet, you'll see a red shoebox. The glasses are not in there. Turn around, look behind you in the top desk drawer, behind Aunt Millie's perfume box. The glasses are there. Pull them out. They are made of titanium and other materials which I'm not at liberty to discuss. But they're very effective. So, be warned, be careful, keep the glasses with you, and Godspeed. This message will self-destruct. Good afternoon, Mr. Bond. What are you doing, Pillow Hand? Uh, I don't know. Please take a seat, Mr. Bond. I hear the from here to die for. You say you don't know, Pillow Hand, but I feel if anyone were to know, it would be you. Ah, Mr. Bond. Deceptive as ever. Well, let's get into the meat and potatoes of the shall we? I was under the impression that we were having seafood. Yes. Yes, we are. Hello, Hand. What do you want? Me? I don't want anything. It's what you want, Mr. Bond. Do you want to vanquish your mortal enemy, the great and mighty Pillow Hand? I just like my friends back, please. Ah, Mr. Bond, <coughs> you never fail to disappoint. Very well, then. Over many years, you have played many international espionage games. Cat and mouse back and forth. Screwing through over the many generations. But tonight, it all ends. Tonight, we play the ultimate international spy game. Tonight, we play Uno Attack! You can't be serious! Yes, it says international spy game right on the pot. You say we play this. If I win, do I get my friends back? Yes, you very well do. Very well, I will play your game. How does it work? Well, it is a game of skill and of luck. There are 108 cards in the deck of an Uno attack. And if you have a card in your head that matches the card on top of the draw pile, then you must put it there. Allow me to demonstrate. Mr. Rod, you please do the honors. Why, yes, I will. You see, so if I have this two, and there's a blue two right here, I must also play that. Let's play this game, shall we? Very well. And it is also customary for the hero of the story to go first. Ah yes, I see on top that we have a blue launch missile, so I shall play my blue launch missile now. You did not foresee my blue deactivate missile. Oh, but I did, for I have a blue manual missile override. And yet you have not noticed my blue counter defense missile system. Oh no, and I see now, you have one card left. It means if I play this card, then I will have vanquished you. I will have won, Larry Bond. Oh no, it seems all hope is lost. I must first then don my glasses. Do you think me a fool, Mr. Bond? I know one of you's little gadgets when I see one. Oh no, they are simply my giant green inconspicuous glasses. Gigantic enough to hide a missile locking system. Yes, it is very clearly a gadget. And I will ask you to remove it because I will not have any cheaters in this fair Uno attack game. I don't understand why you get to wear glasses. Fine, and it is my turn, so I have no other choice but to play my card. Ah, I see you have played the virus that disarms my counter missile defense system. But lucky for me, I have my blue hacker who disarms that virus. That such a trivial vice. And now I won. I vanquished my mortal enemy. I vanquished for the great Larry Bond. Now my name, Pillowhand, will go down in infamy. My mind, my skills at no, 
my muscles, it will all be famous. Well, how can your skills live in infamy if you can't best me at a game of dictionary? Yeah, right.